Hey, you should follow us. Wait, are you coming with us? Are you still with us? Father, Father, are you still with us? Yeah, that's right. Teach us the ways of the Bible. Damn right, girl. You should make some holy hand grenades. That'd be pretty awesome. That'd be a pretty cool uh, perk. Father Elias, he can make holy hand grenades. As my voice cracks, because I'm a child. Okay, let us go to Westside Militia. Alright, so we have to go to Westside, which is the most confusing place in existence. Um, mercenary Outpost. Alright, there's a place called Westside Militia HQ, and it's in Westside. And uh, they gave us directions, but I'm very bad with directions. Jeeve, Jeeves, also known as Steve, Steve lost his GPS, so I don't know where this place is. I think this is it. Okay. Mercenary has two A's, by the way. It doesn't. They spelled it wrong. Hello? We came... We murdered people here. Yeah, no, this is... Yeah, this is where we murdered people. Was this... Okay, okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get out of here, everyone. Wipe your feet. Wipe your feet. You gotta wipe your feet. We got all blood. There's a lot of blood in there. Just wipe your feet on the mat. Okay. Alright. You know, I'm just gonna do this real quick. Bow, bow. And nothing. Okay, great. Well, let's go to Miguel's pawn shop. Okay. So we got an email from Captain Fallon. I don't know if it's Jimmy Fallon. He's in the Westside Militia. There's an HQ. It's down the road. He says, come down to the Militia HQ, man. I'm down the road from the pawn shop. Hope to Have see you. That tower on the strip Hope to see up? you there. You see it for miles. Smiles. Okay, down the road from the pawn shop. See, they're there. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, wasn't there a place that I thought was a thing, but then I was like, is that a thing? Because I don't know this game. Westside Co op. Fresh produce. This isn't the game. Hi. Hi there. Welcome to the West. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Okay, I don't know. This is stupid. See you later. Yeah, I don't care about your food. I said goodbye. See you later. I said goodbye. God. Jesus. Oh my God. The nerve of that man. We go in there, automatically starts talking smack. My God. The nerve of the people in this crap hole. All right. We're looking for the West Side Militia. Hey. Hey, guy who's... Hey. Please, just... All right, all right, Dumps McGee. All right, we're looking for a man by the name of Captain Fallon. Oh, is this it? Yep, that's definitely it. They did not take... How did they not realize... I kind of like being a farmer. Sh no one cares! They, they didn't take away the boards. How could you forget to take... Unless that's some kind of weird... No, they just forgot to take away the boards. Play testing. Oh, that's the ground. All right. Good morning, everyone. I enjoy my God. What is this? You people think you can come in here, put pencils on the floor? I don't know where that pencil went. Oh, there it is. Anyhow, Captain Fallon, I presume. I don't believe we've met. I'm Captain Fallon of the West Side Militia. I just said that. If you've come here looking for work, then I might have something for you. Ooh, kisses. What's this about work? Well, there's a small gang called the Scorpions. Scorpions! They're making trouble for the locals, and we need it to stop. The gang itself isn't much of a threat, but the militia's resources go into defending Westside, and I don't have the men to spare. I need someone to take out the leaders of the gang. That should put the rest of them in their place. Interested? Sorry, I was yawning. What'd you say? Why would I get, what would I get out of this? I can offer you 50 caps per kill. That's 150 in total. How does that grab you? Like a small child hoping that I don't murder it. Uh, 75 per grabs me better. So long as you do a good job, I- Boom, shakalakas, I'll take it. Good. The Scorpions hang out at the Monte Carlo Suites, just to the south. There are three leaders you need to kill. Yvette, Roller, and Stella. Good luck and try not to get killed. Don't worry, the only one getting killed is them. Ah, uh, coffee mug. Hi. Howdy. How? How? Oh, howdy. I kind of like being a farmer. Oh. 
Wow, you sure? Yeah, I don't. You don't look like a farmer. All right, so we're gonna go over there, do our job. We'll come back, talk to uh, Captain Crunch, and uh, ask him the rest of his questions. Is gonna be wow. We are gonna have so much fun. Monte Carlo sweets. That's where we're gonna murder everyone. Murder everyone. Monte Carlo. This is where the people live. This is where they die. I met a man who died. I call him the dead man. Because he's a dead man. Don't mind me, I was aiming for the wall. Really, Cuddles? Really? Goes invisible and runs in front of me. Oh, all right. Good work, everyone. Bloodbath, and we're gonna be taking all the soap home. Let's get to our best friend. All right, sweet. Um, let's see. I cross these emails off Weep. Weep. all right so after this mission I, I believe um, the good captain will have some more missions for us in a few days so we'll talk to him we'll ask him uh, about his, uh, his childhood his past we'll say hey how are things doing with the family and I say I'm sorry my family was burned in a in a carousel accident. I said, oh my god, I'm so sorry. Is that how you got your beard? He says, yes, it was burned down my face. Hello again. What can I do for you this time? Show me some loving. Who are you? Like I told you, my name's Captain Joe Fallon of the hmm. Westside Militia. Who? I'm a former NCR soldier, so it made sense to put me in charge. Being one of the only ones around with military experience, that is. Everyone else really enjoys being a, a farmer. Have you ever seen any real combat? Yeah. I have. I was part of the first battle of Hoover Dam. Awesome. Barely made it out, and I saw plenty of my friends die in there. All right, not awesome. I think that's part of the reason I left the NCR. Didn't want to have to go through something like that again. Yep, becoming a mercenary. Never have to fight anyone. Why'd you leave the NCR? Joining the army. Wasn't at all like I thought it was going to be. No. I thought it would be about helping people and being a hero. It just... it just wasn't. Are you in charge of the whole militia? I don't have absolute power over it. No one does. But my word is generally respected around here. What if you asked everyone to wear silly hats? I'm sorry, you're boring me, Captain Fallon. I apologize. What does the militia do? We keep the people safe here from threats, both outside and domestic. Without us, this place would be as lawless as Freeside. Yeah, this place is pretty dumpy. Uh, Yvette Ro and Roller are dead, but Stella wasn't there. I think she was, like, having a coffee break or something. Okay, well, here's the payment for the two of them. As for Stella, we took a gang member prisoner the other week. See if he knows something. Oh, I'll do it. <clears throat> on the strip, the one you can see for miles. I hear it ain't sealed up no more. Trying to do a negotiation, interrogation, experimentation, proclamation, mitmation. So, I see they give you cigarettes in this joint. That's good. That's good. You know, if you're in my, uh, if you were in my jail, you'd be a dead man right now. Carve your face off and put it on the wall. Put a little dartboard behind it. See if I could score a few uh, points through your eyeballs. That's right, your eyeballs. Cut your nuts off and put them on the back of my truck. Tell them that's my truck nuts. So, the commander over there has agreed for a transfer to my prison. Unless, of course, you don't want your truck nuts. Tell me what you know. Tell me what you know now. Damn it. Hey, man, how about you let me out of here? Tell me where Stella is. No way, man. I'm not giving up. Nah, no way, man. Tell me and maybe I can get some of you that jet you're so obviously crazy. Tell me before I have to start breaking fingers. Tell me before I get some of that jets. You can? I mean, no, screw you. I'm not telling you anything. Are you sure? Withdrawal only gets worse the longer it goes on. 
It won't be pleasant, little baby. All right, all right. There's this place she likes to hang out. This whole farm to the north. It's probably where she is. Now the check. Give it to me. Here you go. Now get away from me. Whatever, truck nuts. Whatever, bitch. Suck my truck nuts. They say the legion's bringing in no, from no, 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 no. They must be getting ready to attack. Chop his balls off and carve his face. That's my payment. Not right, Steve? We're gonna have a go kart festival. You're invited. Let's keep talking about bullcrap. All right, people. We gotta kill some lady. Typical standard procedure: shoot, shoot, banana, shoot. Show the ass and toot, toot, toot. Let's go, people. It's in a free show. Getting paid by the minute. The old lady lived near the mountains, and she fed all the cats baloney, but it was sour baloney, and so the cats would get very sick, and I would have to come down with fruit roll-ups and uh, chub burgers and feed the cats, and it was, you know, it would, but over time she learned not to feed cats spoiled food, and so things became better in the Valley of Kite. Ah, yes, the Valley of Kite. Now, is that the farmhouse? They better have taken them boards off that damn door is all I'm saying. Swear to God, if I if I can go through that door but there's boards on it, I'm a slap. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Ain't nothing here, just a cow who wants some milk. Cover him. Cover him. Wait, cuddles. It was a trap. Cuddles, did you seriously... He's, he's, okay. Yeah, that's how you deal with the ponytail. Real nice and clean. Oh, wait, no, I got chopper head off game. Oh, come on. Alright. Um, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter what I pick. Doesn't matter what I pick, no it doesn't. Whoa, holy shice. You have a good day. And so we went back to our hero. Wonder if that guy overdoses on the Jets. The Jetsons. Meanwhile, back in Hobo Town, where all the hobos live and dream of a better life, where hot dogs come out of the sewers. Ah, yes. Well, I got you, ma'am. Oh, Luka. she's a dead woman. I killed her. Great work. You've proven yourself to be quite efficient. Maybe I'll have some more work for you in the future. Here's your payment. I'm gonna sleep in the closet. You have any more work? Oh, okay. What can I do? Do you have any more work? No, sorry. Nothing at the moment. Well, well, well. Unbelievable. Bye. Maybe we should up some crime here. Looks like it, the war is Isn't that right? I hear the NCR is bringing in elite troops. Isn't that right, Captain Dog Dogs? All right, all right, all right. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. All right, so I'm gonna wait for a little bit. I'm gonna piss in the backyard. And, uh... Yeah, we'll be back, everyone. It's time to make you pay for what you've done. All right, so Commander Fenton just appeared. He's got a mustache. He told me I'm a bitch to track down. I took out a whole outpost, you guys. You really think the four of you stand a chance? We'll see how tough you are once your brain's all over the floor. Listen, Commander Fenton, moody moody. Wait, there's four of you? All I see is a bunch of hobos and a bunch of mercenaries who don't want to fight. And Steve's ass. You're dead, Fenton. Whoa, 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 calm down. Come on. All right. There's plenty of loving to go on where that came from. Commander douchebag. Your orders. Now you're naked. Now you're naked. Everyone knows what you look naked. All right, let's see. Can I pick up his helmet? I got a bunch of...
bunch of crap outfits. Okay, um, Jesus. Didn't I picked up all this stuff? What was he wearing? Was he not wearing clothes? All right, whatever. Okay, uh, let's see this note. The orders do to track down and eliminate Al Chesbreach and anyone accompanying them. The target is responsible for the attack on a New Vegas outpost and must not be allowed to get away with their actions. Bring me back the head or whatever's left of it after you're done. You'll be paid. Commander Aldis. I have no idea which mission that was from. But I do know I'm going to have to murder everyone. Again. And so my adventure of death and bloodlust continued. No one could stop me. No one. Oh no, Nelson. Oh god, I hate this place. Guys, still fighting Legion? Are you shooting dogs? Make up your mind. Alright. I don't know what kind of foul power these uh, mercenaries have, but we're going to be taking them out. Spick and spam. Shoot first, ask question later. Possibly pick up some notes that reveal all their information. And we will be good to go, everyone. We will be good to go. There's some Legion over there just chilling. Not realizing Nelson's gone. Because they're a bunch of douchebags. Oh, I see it. I see that pretty steel door waving at me from a distance. And I'm going to be waving back with my own lead. Oh, yeah. Father Stanley. Send a few words to baby Jesus to protect us in our time of need. Possibly. Send some protection for the mercenaries. Because they're going to need it more than us. Yeah. I then immediately stepped on a mine and died. Hello, how's everyone doing? How are you? How are you today, Mr. Man? You slowly walk up to me. We've been expecting you. Come with me. Commander would like to speak to you personally. Oh. Oh, I'm not going. Okay. Follow me. And don't touch anything. I'm going to touch every... Oh, and that disappeared. Oh. So you're the one that's caused all the trouble at the outpost. I have to admit, you're not at all what I was expecting. I'd be impressed if it wasn't my men you killed, but it was you, and you have to pay for it with caps or with blood. With blood? How much would it take to pay off the debt? I'll pay in blood, would it, but it won't be my own. With blood? That means we'll kill you. Oh, how much would it take to pay off the debt? I'll pay in blood, but it won't be my own. Is there a third option? I'll tell you what, since I'm feeling generous today, I'll give you a third option. The chance to work off your debt. Blake had two uncompleted missions when you murdered him. If you can complete them, then I'll consider us even. What are the missions? First one, our client wants us to eliminate a group of settlers that recently claimed a piece of land outside of Vegas. Second, I'd rather not go into it unless you decide to accept my offer. Why does your client want them dead? That's not our business. It's not yours. Okay, I'll do it. No, I ain't doing that. I ain't some hussy bitch who goes around killing settlers, poking them in the nose like, like a man who doesn't know the difference between a beaver and a... And a, and a horseman. I'm not doing any of your dirty jobs, Lisa Aldis. Then we go back to the two other options. What'll it be? How much would it take to pay off the debt? Ten thousand. If it seems extortionate, that's because we'd rather, we'd rather kill you, but I have to be practical about these things. How about you kill me, and then you take my caps? Or how about, better yet, I'll pay in blood, but it won't be my own. Also, purple doesn't suit you, you bitch. So be it. Come on, men, to arms. Lisa Addis is gonna get shot in the mouth. Yep, that's Cuddles.
And that's me shooting Cuddles in the ass and somehow crippling his, his, his head.